If you're planning on operating an authentic British pub in the United States, it helps to have an owner from Manchester, England. I don't think it hurts to have the general manager be born and raised in the UK. This is the formula that made Churchill's Pub a Savannah favorite since 1996 and inspired the destination guide to stop by for a plate of bangers and mash. Bangers and mash is going on. English style pork sausage, lightly seasoned. Um, we cook it in bass ale, first of all, then it gets on the char grill, uh, mashed potatoes, English style homemade gravy, and the veg of the day. Or fish and chips. That, that is great. The thing that we will sell more of on any given evening than anything else will be the fish and chips. Plus other favorites like shepherd's pie and Lancashire hot pot. Anything British, pretty much. Churchill's has been rolling out favorites like this since its July 4th opening 15 years ago. Back then, Royston was the chef, and Churchill's was in a smaller space on Drayton Street. Then in 2001, Royston moved from Savannah, and in 2003, Churchill's burned down. Instead of rebuilding on Drayton, the owner Andy Holmes moved into this three-story space on bustling Bay Street. Churchill's opened again in 2004. Day after Christmas, Boxing Day. With 9,000 square feet to play with, Churchill's now has two banquet rooms, a rooftop terrace, large dining area, and a huge bar. 34 foot solid mahogany bar um, was actually manufactured in England, um, shipped across to Savannah in many, many, many pieces. The liquor bottles even hang upside down on optics like in a traditional British pub. And they've got 22 beers on tap in the main bar. Way better. I mean, I can barely remember the uh, previous location. Right now, I really like the small craft boarding from Heavy Seas, and the left hand milk stout's really great too. But the puzzle completely came together in 2008 when Holmes asked Royston to come check out the new Churchills. Came down for a visit, loved the place, and he said, you know, it was a bit of a loaded question. Um, would you be interested in taking over the kitchen again? Thought about it, loved the place, we decided to move back down to Savannah. I was the chef here for a year and a half, and now I'm the general manager. And Churchills has never been better. I think it's the atmosphere and the people. Our regulars are great, our food's great, so why not? We got a steak sandwich and a fish and chips. Very good. It's like being at home, friendly faces make you feel good about being here. Can't pass up shepherd's pie. Yep, I got the shepherd's pie too, and uh, of course you gotta get the onion rings. Mmm, tasty. Why do I think it's the best pub in Savannah? I think it's got pretty much something for everyone. Um, with the authentic feel that people are attracted to if they've taken a trip to Britain, if they spent any time living in England. Yeah, for sure, it's very good on dry. And found it, you know, surprisingly good for what they were expecting from just a pub. <laughs>